Hey everyone, you're watching at assist.net and today's video is going to be about how you can permanently delete your Discord account using your mobile device. So if you are interested, make sure to watch the video till the end and without any further delay, let's get started with the video. Alright, so first of all, you just need to open the Discord app on a mobile device. And then you have to tap the three lines that's given at the top left corner. From here, you have to tap the Discord icon that is given at the bottom right corner. And this will take you to your profile section. Now, what you need to do is from here, you have to go to my account under user settings. And if you will scroll down to the bottom, you will see the option to delete account. All right. So if you will press that, it will ask you that you own servers in order to delete or disable your account you must first transfer ownership of all servers that you own all right so in case if you have created any of the servers on discord first of all you will need to transfer their ownership only then you will be allowed to delete your discord account so i will show you how you can do that so press ok and go back and then you have to go to the settings of your server that you have created on Discord. So that's my server name at the top. Now you have to press the three dots given next to the name of your server. And from here you have to go to the settings of that server. All right. Now if you will scroll down to the bottom, you will see a few options under user management. Now to transfer the ownership of your server, you have to go to members. So this will show you a list of your friends that are connected to you on that server. You can transfer the ownership to any of your friends that you want. What you need to do is you just have to press the three dots that is given next to their name. And this will give you a few options. The last one says transfer ownership. All right. So simply tap that. Then go through the information that they provide you that I acknowledge that by transferring ownership of the server to this person, it officially belongs to them. So you have to understand that once you will transfer the ownership, you will no longer be the owner of that server and you will not be able to manage it. All right. So yeah, you have to press select this information that you agree with it and then you have to tap transfer. So doing that will remove you as the owner of your server now you can go back to the settings and here now you can again press delete account so as you can see now it is asking for your password so it means you have successfully transferred the ownership of your discord account your discord server and now you can delete your discord account so for this, you need to remember your password as well. Otherwise, you won't be able to delete your account. All right. So once you have entered the password of your Discord account, you again have to tap delete. And this will log you out of the Discord app and will schedule your account for deletion. And now if you will go back to the email address that was linked to your Discord account, you will see that you have received an email from Discord. Let's see. So that's the email that I have just received from Discord that, hey person, we have received a request to permanently delete your account. Your account has been deactivated and will be permanently deleted after 14 days. Just in case you change your mind or did not request to permanently delete your account, please log into Discord to cancel this request. All right. So your account has been deactivated now. And it will be permanently deleted after 14 days from today. All right. Now, in case within these 14 days, if you want to get it back, you just have to normally log into your account and they will let you get it back. All right. So that's how you can permanently delete as well as recover your deleted Discord account. That was all for this topic. I hope you found this video helpful. And if you still have any doubts, you can ask me in the comment section down below. And you can also visit my website that 